Welcome back to another video. Today we are going to set up the export results QSM add-on. And you can launch your own disposable WordPress environment using this service called InstaWP. You can use this service to follow along with our tutorials. It has amazing free features and the pro version is also quite affordable. So check out their website at instawp.io. Okay, so from your WordPress dashboard, click QSM. Okay, so this is the QSM dashboard. And if you have not installed Quiz and Survey Master, there is a link in the description to a video that shows you how to get started. Once you're on this dashboard, click Extend QSM with Pro Add-ons. Here we have three pricing plans. You can select one of these to purchase add-ons as a pack. Click Add-ons to find the Export Results add-on. Okay, here it is. Click Add to Cart. On this page, all you need to do is follow the checkout process. And once you're done, you will receive your license key as well as a link to download your add-on. So I'm gonna show you guys how to set up the add-on. So let's go back to our dashboard. Hover over plugins, then click add new. Click upload plugin at the top. Here you can click this button to choose the file from your computer or you can simply drag the plugin from your download location, then click Install Now. Once it's done, click Activate Plugin. Once you've activated the plugin, hover over QSM at the bottom, then click Add on Settings to install your license key. Next to Export Results, click Settings over on the right hand side. Once this page opens, paste your license key into this field right here. Once you're done, click Save. Okay, so the next step is to configure the add-on settings. The first option lets you choose the quiz you wanna export. Next, we have filter results by date. So here you can select the beginning and ending date of your results. Um, if you leave it blank, it will export all results. So for the next options, we can only select yes or no. So there's a companion guide that shows you what each of these options mean. It's actually from the Quiz and Survey Master documentation. I'm going to quickly show you what this looks like. Here it is. And the link to this article will be included in the description for this video. You can take a look at each of the options and view their descriptions as well. So let's continue configuring the export. Let us not include timestamps. And as for contact information, let's leave it as yes. Include user ID, no. So basically just go through this list and select the information that you want to include in your export. Um, I don't want to include users question comments field, so I'm going to select no for this option. I'm going to leave all of these as yes, um, up until let's say total question field. Let's select no for this option. Um, and for the final two, I will select no. All right. So once you're done, click export my results at the bottom. And once you have downloaded your export, you can open it with your favorite software. 